hi guys welcome to my youtube channel it's a fresh new year 2024 and uh, for those who are looking to get started uh, with e-commerce this this is the video for you more so if you're looking to use uh, the shopify platform this is the video for you so in today's video we're going to talk about how you're going to add a payment provider uh, in your shopify store and one of the most recommended and best providers that i know the most reliable payment providers is dpo group yeah so i want to show you the step-by-step -step process let's say you've already created your own shopify store and the next thing now you want to collect payments uh using a payment gateway provider like dpo now to get started what you need is uh you need to log into your store okay and uh i'm sure most of you for those who are using shopify you're familiar with this dashboard so on the dashboard you're supposed to come here and click start settings sorry settings so on the settings part the next thing you're supposed to do is uh you go straight away to the payment section okay from the payment section what you see, what you need to do is uh first uh, just pause pause there pause there pause there pause there pause there now let's go back to dpo let's say i know there are several payment providers in kenya and uh if you choose to go with dpo uh you need to go straight to their website first and uh initiate a request for for payment gateway provision and that's what i'm gonna show you how i did it so what you go what you do just go to youtube type dpo group okay dpo group come here and then click uh, the first uh, website let's say dpo group and then from here this is where now you go and this is where you come here let, let me show you instant this you can just you can uh, there are several ways of actually uh speaking with uh, or making an inquiry dpo the first way is uh, you can actually initiate a live chat as you can see here you can see amanda is here so that's where you can initiate a, a conversation about how you look into integrate or you can just click on this instant sign up button where it will start asking you for all those questions that is needed so for me i did the same i went all the way and uh, give out uh initiated a conversation with dpo and later that's when uh they ask for a few document require requirements here and there and uh once we are done and uh, my account was already set up with dpo they sent me some registration uh, uh links and that's why we are going to go through so let's say you've already initiated a conversation with dpo and uh they've actually as accepted you in uh integrating uh their, their payment gateway into shopify the, they'll actually give you a link that uh, tells you to actually download an app called dpo pay as you can see here now the next thing i'm going to do is uh click here and install this app called dpo pay and uh, what happens it installs yes it it takes it takes you to the shopify dashboard and asks you now to install so that's what i'm going to do i'm installing it give it a few seconds and then now from here this is where they start asking me for the company token and service type okay so things like company token that's what they'll give you so that's what you're supposed to put it here so i'll quickly just fill in here and then i will click here and uh, proceed after typing in the company token the service type click save settings wait a few seconds and the next thing it will take you to this window over here where uh, the dpo pay app is already installed now what i'm supposed to do is uh, it's just uh, activate some of the payment services that i'm willing to maybe accept as payment so in this case for me since uh, this is a kenyan company and we, we are selling computers we can accept visa payments in fact the funny thing is uh, everything here is actually 
is actually this is all enabled so i'm just supposed to enable disable what i don't feel like i'm going to use for example now since like uh, airtel tigo money i'm not so sure about that uh, mtn and everything okay let me just for the sake of uh, you know you don't know where you you're gonna get your customer so i'll just leave it open the way it is and then i'll proceed here and click activate after activation it says dpo pay is activated so i think that's about it so let me just uh, and also make sure that the payment capture is automatic as you can see here yeah so let me just go back and confirm some few things if everything is fine so right now i'm able to take uh so as you can see dpo i am able to take payments from uh, dpo and uh, paypal but first i need to make sure let me just check out as a customer just to make sure that this uh, dpo thing is really activated now first thing first let me just proceed and uh, make up try to make a purchase and then see if uh, the checkout shows dpo okay so as you can see here what i want to do is just uh, let me just click here buy now and then it takes me to the checkout page where i can just fill in my my details here and now see how if i can see the payment yeah that's correct as you can see dpo is actually there so that's good we actually good to go now yeah so that's it guys if you're looking for a reliable payment gateway this is the video for you go for dpo pay and i uh, hope you have a prosperous uh, 2024 going ahead for e-commerce services or payment installation on your e-commerce uh, website feel free to get in touch my name is creative keegan and i'll see you on the next video bye